guys welcome back to the no spot man this is fc call on career mode this is episode six episode one of season two man it's the beginning of season two and we are in the europa league the first game we're playing shark and we're going to shark stadium of which is Velten's arena that's where it's gonna be happening. Shark with the first attack. They managed to score the first goal on the 32 minute. That was a marvelous hit, man. And then on the 40th minute, they come back, but Horn was there in the right place to make a save. Our first attack was on the 43rd minute when Fernando took a shot, but again, the goalkeeper made a brilliant save. Another chance in the last minute of the half. We got a chance and we miss it. Then second half begins. 54th minute. Gorez tries a, pull, a pullback pass to El Sharawi. It didn't work. Shark came back with an attack on the 64th minute. A shot came in. Good save by Horn again. But a follow-up shot was very weak. Then we launch another attack on the 67 minute we find Gores with a long through ball there Gores is through he took a shot goalkeeper make a save again we did try man we did try in this game on the 74th minute again another chance they tripped Connard. he continued to run gave the ball to the player he missed it last minute of the game they dribbled my player then this okay let's forget that happened next game this is the second game of the episode six ah we need to win it we're playing union berlin and we are away so let's hope that we do get that w on the fifth minute we got a chance with Cornet, who is through he's running through and then he passed it straight to Gerrers. It's not Gerrers, it's Bozard, my mistake. Bozard scored the, the first goal of the game. It is 1-0 on the sixth minute. Then on the 11th minute, they got a chance. Free, it's Lacadia, who shot, Horn save, but then a follow-up shot went straight to him. He scored. Then we had to wake up from that dream, man. That was a nightmare. Guarez got a chance. He scored on the 16th minute. We make it 2-1. Again, we took a lead. Good finish by him there. It was a good shot, good pass, good movement. Then on the 17th minute, Guarez. Look at this. He just skipped past the player there and then he passed the ball straight to Bozoir to score his second. Oh my god, that was brilliant. That player was trying to slide tackle him and then he was like so smart on the slide tackle. Then on the 23rd minute, Bozoir again is coming back with a cross this time. He finds El Sharawi who headed it home. It is 4-1 after just 20 four minutes in the game then on the 31st minute another chance Konat is true Konat is coming forward he passed the ball they find Gorez or finish it neatly there's no goalkeeper there so the goalkeeper was focusing on the cross and Gorez was just alone there it's just a tap in then on the 38th minute Konat back to Gorza to Gorez, Gorez failed to take a shot, but then Bozat did take a shot. 57 minutes, Gorez completed his hat trick with a brilliant finish. That was a neat finish, man. I love it. 7 1 on just 58 minutes in the game. That was a very good performance for me. Then on the 64th minute, Bozat again, he cut inside, he took a shot, it was blocked, Bozat with the header, a goalkeeper with the save. The ball went back to El Sharawi with a brilliant shot, assist goes to Guerrero. Then, all hell break loose here. Mendy with the goal, on the 70th minute. I don't know, we always lose concentration, once we got the lead, we lose concentration. 
74th minute again, it's Mendy again, it's true. He took a shot. It's not Mendy, it's Tiemi. Something like that. Then on the 81st minute, again, it's another goal. It is 8-4. God, we should have won, won this game like 8-1. Next game, it's the third game of the episode. We're playing Start God. They're coming from the from League Two, man. To myself, I'm thinking this should be like easy game, man. It should be an easy game for us. But then, okay, let's see. Gonzalez, seven minutes, boom, a goal. I was shocked. I should have bought Gonzalez in the first season. I didn't. 24th minute, they got another chance, but they missed that time. Then our first chance came on the 29th minute, Quarez with a good finish. It was 1-1 one, one on the 29th minute. Quarez is scoring um, a little bit. Then on the 39th minute, Conard passed it straight to Fernando, who gave it to Bozard, Bozard with a net finish. It's 2-1 on the 48th minute. So at this point, you can see we're coming back. But look at that. A mistake by my defender gave it straight to Gonzalez. Look at the finish. Gonzalez with his second. Then we got the chance with Timo Weir, who just shot it straight to the player. But then the follow-up shot was just rubbish. Let's look at the league table. We're sitting on the seventh position. Three games. One draw, one lose, one win. Not a good start, really. It's really not a good start. Let's go to our next game. We're playing Bayern Munich. Kodaes got a chance on the fifth minute. As early as fifth minute, we get that chance, man. I was so happy. He bulldozed everybody, but he missed the target. Then... On the 21st minute, Bayern Munich coming forward with a very good attack, good passing there, dribbled by Gennabry, hit the post, back to Luis Vasquez. Look at it again. How quick was Vasquez there? How quick was Vasquez there? Okay. It's fine. Let's forget that happens. Let's continue with the game. They're coming forward again. They took a shot. They hit the post this time. Then look at that. Way through Junabri. He's through. He took a shot. Let's look at that. Wait. What happened there? Junabri missing one-on-one -on -one, like twice. Then on the 46th minute, a cross came in. Look at that header, man. How do you head the ball from that distance? Obviously, it's not going to have power. Final minutes of the game, this happened. Fuck it. I'm done. I'll never beat Bayern. I'm struggling to beat Bayern Munich, man. It's the only team that, like, I'm struggling to beat in this league. I did beat Dortmund in the final. Then... Let's go to Europa League with the team that is unknown. I'm not even going to call that name because I don't know what is it. He bulldozed them again. The bulldozer, Guedes. But the keeper save. Back to Guedes again. Good touch. Good finish. It is 1-0 after 13 minutes in the game. Honestly speaking... My number 33, that defender is really struggling to fit in. Whereas again, he came back. On the 27 minutes, he missed the target completely. Cornet, on the 33rd minute, he took a shot. Good save by the keeper. A header following up, but keeper made a save. Whereas again, with good control there. He turns, looking for options, gave it to Fernando. Fernando, out wide, he gave it to Skov. Skov, he continues with his run. Skov, they opening up for him, he gave it to Puzad. Puzad, 
pullback fair Guedes. Roger Guedes with the net finish. It is 2 0 after 69 minutes in the game. A corner coming in, well defended, but straight to the opponent. Again, we defended it well. We gave it to Timo well. What the hell? I was gonna sell that defender before the game ends. Timo Way was through. He finished it. That defender will live to regret that for the rest of his life. It's 3 0 after 87 minutes. I don't know what he was thinking. The next game of the episode, we're playing Dortmund. Jesus Christ, it couldn't get any better in the Bundesliga, isn't it? Holland, look at that. Yeah. That was a neat finish, but really now. Just 13 minutes in the game, we already won it down. Oh, Jesus. Did you see that skill? It was hazard. He, he, he was really feeling it. He was destroying me. Passed inside. He finds Emre Chen. Emre Chen passed it back. A Korea with a shot, but he missed it. Then on the 46th minute, they're coming back with Sancho. Again, Sancho. Look at him toying with my players. A pass back to Wetzel, but Korea with the finish again. Oh my God, that was a beautiful. A cross coming in. Okay, fuck it. It's draining. There's nothing I can do. But we still have a chance on the 89 minutes with the young man Kong. Kenong. It's Koning. Yeah, it's Koning. It's the youth player. He scored. But it really doesn't mean much. That doesn't mean much to me. But because it's a young man, I'm happy. Last game of the episode, we're playing Hertha Berlin. Oh God, another team that is always giving me heading. Straight to Piantech, straight on the scoreboard on the 32nd minute. That was the first chance of the game. And Piantech just don't miss those. Lecky, Lecky, on the 61st minute, as he scored with a shot, but oh God. A corner with the finish. Okay. We switch off now. The ball back to Skiri. Skiri. Good finish, Skiri. Then, on the 78 minutes, Guerrez again is through. Guerrez with a shot. Guerrez, it's a goal. It is 2 nil. After 79 minutes, we managed to equalize the... Jesus Christ. These boys, they're going to give me heart attack. Two quick goals that they considered and they reply with two quick goals of their own. Then it's Connet again through. Connet dribble players. Oh,